Welcome back, pop stars. I like that. That's that. Flows I think off I the do. It, just, it implies that we have some sort of singing element to our show that's not there. Cheap bass. Cheap bass. We're shopping this one still, you guys. Are we? we? Have, They're I pop culture stars, you know. <laughs> So we're watching episode five of The Haunting of Bly Manor, uh, episode called The Altar of the Day. It's just not as fun doing the spooky voice when it's not Halloween. It's not October, but you have to, you started it, so you have to finish it. Which episode are we watching? Number five. The Altar of the Day. <laughs> so we finally found out that she did kill someone. He called it. He called it. The line's busy. Called it! Uh, we got Danny the Gardener and Danny's ex-dead ghost in some sort of a love triangle. We got a Bella and Edward and Jacob situation. So who are you? Team Ghost or Team Gardener? Ghost or Gardener? <laughs> Do you think she's actually gonna end up with the ghost? I'm the type of persistent in my relationships where if I die, I'd You're... be like... Well, no! Well, you gonna kill yourself? No, that's bad! I'm waiting. We still need to figure out what her deal is. Yeah, I, I want to clarify. I don't think she's actually a vampire. I just think there's something not human about her. I would say she's been a ghost the whole time or something to that oh. effect. She would always find her way back to peace within her daily routine. Do you think the guests at this wedding are getting really tired of this lady telling a story? <laughs> Memories fade or they're wrong. Hey, you two should kiss. We can't count on our future either. Alcohol will do that to you. Get you real depressing. <laughs> I feel like I was patronized, but in such a soothing voice. <laughs> it's a horrible thing to say, but I'll say it. I don't care that you broke your elbow. It's a bit of a relief. Uh, it's not horrible. No, nah, man. Mom was dragging you down. She was oh, dead weight. Oh my god! <laughs> Sorry, Miss Rizzo. <laughs> I hope you don't get <laughs> sick. <laughs> I'll take care of you. <laughs> you and me. Oh, we still can. Go with him. Be happy. I'm turning into a pumpkin. Damn it! Spirits have to stay at the house that they died, so she's probably stuck there. Are you Hannah? Uh, I'm in trouble. Did his mustache get mustachier? It looks like it did. It's a lot. It feels different. way more mustachy. Um, but Charlotte, um, Mrs. Wingrave, she had to um. I mean, it's all this a posh restaurant they could use you. Is she trying to like warn him? Like, why do you want to work at this haunted house? <laughs> Sorry, will you, uh, will you excuse use me? Use your words. Oh shit, she's stuck in a time warp again. Let's do the time warp again. She could be like Doctor Manhattan, where she's experiencing all time all at once. All at once. I was kind of thinking that. Daddy. You'll tell me all about how numbingly constant everything is. Right so this is the beginning of everything. Those kids were little. Yeah. But I don't think she has control over where she is at any point. Nah. <sighs> oh god, don't make me cry. <sighs> no, don't do it. Ah. Oh. What the fuck are you doing <laughs> out here? Somehow, him and you. however she is there, it's just fine. Oh my. Are they perfectly? Oh my. Splendid. I'll arrange a ride. She can't or leave, bro. Serve, you can stay here, you know, for as long as forever, like. forever. Forever. God damn it! Have a drink. Don't drink it. This is like worse than Groundhog's Day. At least with Groundhog Day, you can have like a bearing of like what's going on and when. I'm gonna push her off the ladder. <laughs> I'm sorry. Like he's being creepy. What the? Stop. See, that's less creepy and more shitty. At that point, you're a little shit. <laughs> I don't want to be mean towards Stay children. Stay your hand, Rizzo. Let's see what he does. I will fucking end you. Hey, that's mean. Ah! Fine. Maybe she just shouldn't drink. Think about it. I don't know. She always seems like she's really fucking confused. The last time I saw you, you were banging on about me having Owen's batter in my mouth. Oh, you thought you were hiding? What are you talking about? I've been here vacuuming. What? I'm sorry, you're interrupting me while I'm vacuuming. Cracks. 
I mean, she's about to jump again. Stop it. What am I up to? No, you're taking things that aren't yours. I love her, though. I, oh, she, she is just... I love Hannah. There's them, and then there's us. We're the help. At least he said there's us. He didn't say there's you. I'll have the necklace, please. <laughs> Get it. I'll have the necklace, please. <laughs> It should be nice for Damiana. One day I'm gonna be a ghost. Touch it. Let's see where we go next. This is kind of fun. Oh God. Did she see her do it? Which means. So what's interesting is Owen was just talking about his mom who has dementia, and she's basically experiencing what dementia might be oh. like. He's a good boy, and he would never do anything to hurt you. Is that what you were gonna say? His parents. Is this like a child yeah, therapist office now? Like I feel like he's like. Not what do you think you're doing? Hey. That was creepy. <laughs> that was creepy. Or do you want to die a horrible choking death? Hmm? Oh, Hannah. Honestly. What little shitty... See, he's just a little... Honestly. <laughs> he's less creepy and more of just being like an asshole. Yeah, he's like, I'm gonna be a man who grows up and get whatever I want. He needs an attitude adjustment is what he needs. Or whatever that looks like. He needs a Dr. Phil moment. Catch me outside, how about that? <laughs> Miles, Miles, we're not finished here. You're not gonna catch him, you're gonna end up oh, somewhere else. Miles. And Hello. you should know that Hello. by now. Marriage is like religion in a way. Okay, you are so told her husband to have is gone. blind faith in God, even though you can't see him. And you're told to have blind faith in your husband, even if you hardly ever see him. How long can you actually believe in something? You know what I believe I mean, in, true. bitch? These hands, mother! Don't talk about my husband, bitch! I used to be a daddy's girl. Damn, that shit switches quick. This is why Hannah's been acting so goddamn weird. <laughs> I've never met anyone like him. I mean, I know he's not Zena. <laughs> He scares me too. But in the best way. Ah. That's not. That I'm sounds unhealthy. Rebecca, I'm sorry I mentioned it. Yeah. I'm sorry I appeared in the middle of this conversation. Is that Miles? Or oh, Miles with the lighter. I just don't understand how someone can justify this kid's <laughs> creepy ass actions. More salt in the stew? No, don't put it in your mouth. Well, what are you stewing on? I like him. Paul Miles was a few feet away. He chewed his own leg off to escape the trap. Mm. The poor thing bled to death. That man is a glue trap. And when Rebecca realizes it, she won't come out whole. She'll think she's okay. Until oh she God. realizes she's stuck. That scared me more than <laughs> the ghost. I'm looking at this as an opportunity to hone my skills. Fuck! I don't care about this goddamn interview anymore! You got the job! Stop talking to me, please! Uh, That's why you got the job, right? She's just like, I... I sure, I uh, fuck it. I'll be stuck in this glue trap of a town just like everyone else. You're familiar with glue traps? We talked about that once. Not yet, we haven't. Denial! It's morbid. God, that's what this is. This is... Fuck! There is something fully tormenting her. Just Stop going through doors! I would sit in my bed and never fucking leave. I have to tell you something. I'm pregnant. There's a lady in this house. <laughs> There's a lady in the room staring at us. Henry's never gonna give you the pupilage. He's never gonna make me a partner. And we, the things that we could be in America. I'm gonna move to the land of opportunity. Do you understand what I'm saying? And don't tell anyone. I don't think she's actually there. Yeah, because I'd be like, bu -bu here for you, I promise. Hey! <laughs> you can get out of here, you filthy little pervert, or I'm gonna slap you silly. This is one of my favorites. I don't like this. Hey, this is insane. This I'm so, I'm so sorry. No, I wouldn't go out there. I think this is when it happened. You heard something. I'm sure it's fine. Going back to bed, both of you. That was, that was a nice little reveal. I thought I said go back to bed. What? That's the ghost that stays under the bed. What's that? Ah, oh, he's a ghost. 
lost. I've seen her before. The like others. Five seconds ago when say, she killed you. Stay away from her. Go see what did with his body. Bitch, I don't know. Let me go! Let me go! You bitch! Let me go! Is that why he's awful? Well, still need to slap him. Slap that creepy <laughs> shit personality out of him. Slap him with a Bible. <laughs> he is a ghost child, though. <laughs> I need my blanc. Ah, what's her deal? <laughs> I'm looking at this as an opportunity to hone my skills. In Paris, I was a sous chef, so I only cut vegetables. But here, I'll be putting everything this together. This episode myself. is yeah, making me world. tired. <laughs> For in that sleep of death, what dreams may come when we have shuffled off this mortal coil. It needs to cook a little longer, I think. All right, then. One more time. Don't touch me. <laughs> it's 1987. You're at Bly. Something is wrong with Miles. <laughs> Stupid little kid. Oh, my gosh. <laughs> He's possessed. Get, get out of him! <laughs> Peter Quint, you step away from that boy. Do you hear me? I swear, you're such a bore and you don't know when. To leave well enough alone. Nothing would make me happier than to be arrested by those police you're talking about. To be dragged off this fucking property. Away from this god awful trap. There's got to be something we haven't thought of. Something to get us out of this trap. But I can't. Throw a little kid over your shoulder and take him to the church. Well, guess the power of Christ is gonna compel you. Honestly, Hannah! Ah! Ah! Oh! What? What? Fuck! Oh, we just kill Hannah. That's why she kept seeing the crack. And now she's a ghost. She's and she's even prettier than I imagined. Uh, this shot. Hi, Miles. It's nice to meet you. So pleased to meet you, my lady. Oh. She's been a ghost the, gentleman. the whole time. Nice what did I just say? I'm oh, so sorry. I was, um, good as I, I was miles away. Oh, my Miles, gosh. to meet you. Paris. You and me. While well, we still can. Yes, Owen, I, um, I will go to Paris with you. Because you can't. Yes. I'll alcohol you later. No, wait. Uh, no, no, um... I know the road. It's fine. Wait. Please. Owen! Wait! Wait! You are Hannah Gross. Hannah Gross. Well, that was depressing. All right. Well, that was the last episode of Black. <laughs> <laughs> I'm over it. Um. Well. Okay. So what? What did we? What did? What happened? Well, that. we learned that Anna's stuck, man. She's dead and she's stuck and she can't get away. And so is Peter and probably also Rebecca. Mm -hmm. We know that the Lady of the Lake just kills people because she feels like it. <sighs> well, that was episode five, so, um, so there. If you like watching us cry, <laughs> click subscribe or something. You know, follow us, hit the bell for notifications. We'll have more of these, hopefully happier. I think it's only gonna get worse. <laughs> All right. Well, that's the haunting of Bly Manor. <laughs> On Wednesdays, we wear pink.